This video shows you how to use a sealant gun alongside the sealant cartridge. In the chamber of the sealant gun, you've got an L-shaped piston that has got a circular or round plate, you know, at the bottom. In order to get the silicone sealant cartridge into the chamber of the sealant gun, the round plate needs to move in the chamber's line of travel in the clockwise orientation or the right direction. First, prior to getting the sealant cartridge into the chamber, you need to cut out the profile of what you're trying to um, seal. In this case, the gap is about 8 cm and it matches the profile that we've got on the Fuji kit, which is the blue kit that I've got in my hands. It's important to match the gap so you do not waste um, sealant. So I will cut the nozzle tip at 90 degrees to enable a push fit type application that would propel the sealant at 90 degrees into the groove or gap as opposed to just gliding through at 45 degrees. Here you've got a lever just at the head of the piston so I push that down to enable the round plate you know move you know towards the right direction or the clockwise orientation. If I want the round plate to move in the anti-clockwise or left direction, I, I, could, I just need to squeeze on the trigger or push the head of the piston. Squeezing on the trigger pushes you know, the suction or the hydraulic mechanism in, within the cartridge in the chamber. And you, know, you can see here that I'm applying you know, the sealant at 90 degrees. And for a bigger gap, the greater the gap, the bigger the cut on the nozzle. Then repeat and reproduce the process. Apply the sealant at 90 degrees, OK? That's how to use the sealant gun. If you want something more in-depth on how to select the tool, select the sealant, you know, remove the defective sealant and reseal your bathroom, click on the link in the description. You know, it's more in-depth. Um, it also covers how to use the profiles and the pros and cons, you know, when selecting sealants. And just a quick recap, you know, click on the lever just right before you squeeze the trigger to, you know, to pull out the piston and to get the cartridge into the chamber. You know, you can push the head, you know, of the piston, you know, to, to get the piston to move in the left, you know, direction towards the um, sealant cartridges mechanism or suction or hydraulic, you know, mechanism. The upward movement of the piston in the cartridge pushes out sealant. And that's about it really. Don't forget to subscribe, like and share. It helps the channel grow. Thank you for your time. Thank you for listening and hopefully catch up with you later. Goodbye.